Here with head football coach Paul Winters for this week's locker room report. How can have, uh, having someone back there returning kicks like Deontay Nicholas change the game, change the other team's game plan? Talk a little bit about what that advantage brings to your team. Well, uh, Deontay gives you so much speed, and, and every time he touches the ball, he has the ability to score a touchdown. So I don't know if it changes the game so much, but it, it certainly changes the way teams approach approach you. I think um, after that first kickoff, they realized, well, we're not going to kick it deep anymore. And so we ended up with two fair catches on their next two kickoffs and decent field position. Um, but you'd love for him to have an opportunity to touch it. Schedule obviously becomes more difficult down the stretch here, ranked fifth in the country in strength of schedule. How do you prepare for such a tough slate? Um, and this is kind of where you expected to be, where you wanted to be at this point in the season. Well, uh, when you talk about how tough the schedule it is, um, we play Saginaw. Mm -hmm. We have to prepare for Saginaw, and that's all we have to prepare for. And, and you don't look at the entire picture. You look at what we're doing this week. What are you seeing from Saginaw Valley kind of coming back towards the top of the league after a couple down years? We haven't had a whole lot of success against Saginaw in the past. What do they do well? Um, they're a good defensive football team. They're solid. Um, they run the football well. They've got an outstanding wide receiver that they have ability to get the ball to. They do a lot of things well. Um, but again, it's kind of you, you can't look at the big picture. What we've done against Saginaw, we haven't played them for two years. Mm -hmm. And um, you know, obviously those two years they haven't been very good. And we've been pretty decent. So. Uh, Maybe we would have had two more wins against them. Uh, but all, really all that matters and all we're really concerned about is going out on Saturday and playing the way we're supposed to play. What do we need to do to beat Saginaw Valley on Saturday? Um, number one, I think um, our defense has to play the way they've been playing, uh, stop the run. I mean, just completely limit the run and, and um, force teams to throw the ball and then um, create turnovers with, with them throwing the ball. I think from an offensive standpoint, uh, we need to, to hold on to the football and, and put it in the end zone the way we've been doing pretty successfully all year. All right. Thanks, Coach. All right.